I'm here to offer and ask y'all to please keep my sister Vicky in prayer, Vicky Ackerman. She is in grave condition. She's going to need an operation. I've, it's scheduled, the last I heard, for March 24th this year. And it's a very, very serious surgery. She uh, has a, a very severe form of hernia. <clears throat> Pardon me. Her stomach is actually in her chest cavity. And it's been causing her heart to have troubles. She's needing needs her blood work to improve. So, and it's a nine centimeter size the the hernia or the in the, the hernia in her chest cavity. There's a word for it but I can't I keep forgetting the name of it, the type of hernia. It's not the high hernia, it's worse. So I want y'all to keep her in prayer. And before I just pray, I'm going to read some verses. James chapter 5, 14 through 16. Is any sick among you? Let them call for the elders of the church. Let them anoint him. Let them pray over him, <clears throat> anointing him with oil in the name of the Lord. And the prayer of faith shall save the sick. The Lord shall raise him up. If he have committed sins, they shall be forgiven him. Confess your faults one to another and pray one for another that ye may be healed. The fervent, effectual fervent prayer of a righteous man availeth much. Please keep her in prayer, my sister Vicki Ackerman, that God will heal her of this severe form of hernia. And in closing, I'm going to pray myself. Once again, I'm asking you all to keep her in prayer, and I'm going to close in prayer. Heavenly Father, I come to you now. I ask you, Father, to please touch my sister. Father God, I thank you that when Jesus went to the cross, it says he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. A chastisement of our peace was upon him. And with his stripes we are healed, as it says in Isaiah 53, 5. Father, you say that one of the benefits of the righteous who healeth all thy diseases. We thank you, Father, though this may be a very serious, serious and very painful issue, sickness. I ask you, Father, to come by and touch her body. Father, let the surgeons have a, ha, uh, be with the surgeons as they, tr as they uh, operate. I ask you, Father, to improve her blood work. There is nothing too hard for you. You're able to restore the iron to her blood and other things she may need in there. Touch Vicky, give her peace of mind. Give her peace of heart and touch her body. We thank you, Father, in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless.